interesting things waves can see. <laughs> Today, we're going to be examining constructive things. Now, my assistant Yohi here, she's going to be drawing the diagram for a constructive wave. On a constructive wave, the amplitude would have to be the same and the direction would be counteracting each other. So once they hit in the middle, the two waves would combine into one. As she is drawing right there. And as they split apart, they take back their identities and go back to what they were before. Yoshi. Okay. Now, Assistant Young here is about to draw a destructive wave interference. So, these waves are going to have a positive identity and a negative identity. And once they meet in the middle, they will flatline because waves add up. And after, she messed up a little bit, she will dry, they will resume and continue on and have their formal identities once again. This is the Yahi, back in the house. We started off by making a wave on the slinky, going into a fixed point. Once the slinky, once the wave hit the fixed point, we noticed that the wave didn't change its shape or direction. It can just, it didn't change its shape, only its direction changed. This time we had the slinky and the wave going into a loose end. Once the slinky hit the loose end, it bounced back and due to the loss of energy through friction, the amplitude was decreased. Now that's pretty good.